Amid economic challenges, South Korea is witnessing a surge in interest for digital currency, particularly among its youth, the ENPO generation. Uh, the ENPO generation, aged 20 to 39, is grappling with economic challenges and societal pressures, but finds solace and opportunity in the booming digital market and the promises of Web3 tech. And the generation's troubles began in 1997, when South Korea faced a severe currency crisis, which led to a significant depreciation of the Korean one and required a bailout from the International Monetary Fund. Uh, subsequent restructuring attracted increased foreign investment, resulting in the acquisition of vital infrastructure companies such as the First Bank of Korea and Kumo Industrial by foreign entities. Uh, this heavy reliance on foreign capital made the economy fragile, uh, with companies prioritizing corporate profits over national interests, which then exacerbated inflationary pressures. Uh, rising housing prices uh, fueled by Chinese investment uh, also worsened the housing shortage, particularly in cities like Seoul, where a 60-square-meter apartment uh, can exceed 100 million yen. Uh, the term NPO generation stems from the concept of abandonment, or POGI, leading to the abbreviated PO, which reflects the economic struggles that young Koreans face. Those under 25 often forsake milestones like love, marriage, childbirth, home ownership, and social activities. They were initially coined as the three employed generation in 2011 because of the numerous jobs that members of the demographic held uh, even before youth unemployment uh, figures rose in subsequent years. Um, over time, it has expanded to encompass the five PO generation, which has relinquished job prospects and home ownership, uh, and the seven PO generation uh, were those who have sacrificed relationship and dreams. Uh, it's a harsh reality in the situation exacerbated by the fertility rate, which has plummeted below 1 to 0 0.78. And in societal disparities are evident. The top 3% are elite, which leaves the remaining 97% in the NPO generation to grapple with limited opportunities and a sense of hierarchy. Uh, today, despite these societal and economic challenges, uh, South Korea's Web3 market is experiencing remarkable growth. Uh, uh, the market shows major activity with over 200,000 active users, approximately 15% of whom engage in trading on centralized exchanges. This strong purchasing power has even led to a few a month in kimchi premium for stocks listed on Korean digital currency exchanges with a 5 to 10% premium compared to exchanges elsewhere. In a society plagued by inflation and soaring housing costs, achieving basic necessities becomes increasingly challenging on fixed incomes alone. But not elite majority, 97% of the population, and face limited options, leading to the emergence of the Empo generation. Driven by belief in their ability to break through adversity, they invest in high-risk assets, seeking the one-shot turnaround. A young VC employee uh, commented to me, Web3 exists as an opportunity to expect more from yourself because you don't expect anything from society. Web3 is not just 3.0 of the web. It is 3.0 is a third way for young people who are looking for a new way of life. And uh, in contrast to its previous cautious approach uh, during the ICO bubble, the South Korean government now embraces the uh, potential economic benefits of the digital currency market. Uh, this shift is evident uh, with uh, 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 initiatives including uh, the, uh, the pilot launch of a central bank digital currency, which is coming in the fourth quarter 2024. Uh, additionally, efforts to establish legislation for security token offerings signal a commitment to creating a regulatory framework for asset tokenization. Startups are also leveraging this environment to issue security tokens tied to real estate, facilitated by a sandbox registration system managed at the municipal level. Uh, dubbed as the Medicine Kingdom, South Korea's extensive internet culture sees young individuals spending more time in digital realms than in reality. In this landscape, earning money through conventional means becomes challenging amidst societal constraints and the overwhelming influence of the Internet.
faced with limited avenues for legitimate income, uh, individuals increasingly turn to online platforms to then real-world frustrations, leading to a surge in uh, uh, cryptocurrency gambling, particularly in altcoins and means. So our South Koreans, with their adventurous spirit, favor altcoin investments, according to research, while showing real interest for Bitcoin and Ether. Opinion leaders wield significant influence, despite a prevailing skepticism towards mainstream media among the youth. This has led to the emergence of KOL Telegram communities ranging from 2000 to 1850s. 200,000 members consider pivotal in shaping consumer behavior. Rain uh, good opinion leaders also have a buying base of community members while bad ones mainly attract airdrop hunters and grinders. Good ones tend to give feedback to the project, some while observing that too much airdropping is not good for the quality of the community. Some are even quiet partners of well-known VC firms. Uh, projects need to be recognized by a good group of opinion leaders uh, to find them helpful. Uh, large communities with thousands of members often have strong purchasing power. Uh, at the same time, too many communities are filled with bots and bounty hunters, uh, which you know uh, hinder access to uh, genuine buyers. Uh, Koreans, nonetheless, favor exclusive inner groups, and an excess of these can be uh, generic, prompting serious investors to switch between communities for more focused information. While the tone in South Korea may often be pessimistic, there's still fervor among crypto enthusiasts to find their light in the midst of societal darkness. Uh, this article is for uh, general information purposes and is not intended to be and should not be taken as legal or investment advice. Uh, the views, uh, thoughts, uh, and opinions expressed um, here are the authors alone and do not necessarily reflect or represent the views and opinions of Crypto Loom.